Hi guys, welcome back to Factorio. Apparently something is getting destroyed back there. Okay, so the minute, uh... The minute I go away and put the turrets in another position, then they decide that that is not the angle they want to attack from. Alright, we're gonna have to make two vectors to defend from there. Fortunate set of circumstances, but... That's life. Alright, so we're not quite done this yet. This seed happens to have the worst angles to defend these things from. Oh, these also ran out of coal. Get some more coal. Because we actually still need steel. We actually never really stopped needing steel, but... Oh, uh, yeah. We're gonna spend a bit of time... Are they still at it? There's like just two of them just chewing on something there. Um, I mean, as I said, I every time I rush down there and defend it is is just a waste of time. I need to make sure I don't have to go back down there every time. All right. All right. Let's go back down there. Let's fix that. Then let's fix up the coal, and then then really really hammer out some of the other things we need. Dumb. Yeah, they took out a lot. That's just dumb. Sad story, but it's a it's a case of poor planning on my part, maybe ish. If you want to blame me, but all right, this should be good enough now. Obviously, everything can be planned slightly better, but, you know. Oh, shit. Okay. <laughs> they did not waste any time, apparently. Second wave, go! Thing is, I also don't have enough walls for this as well. So... Oh, I don't have another... Oh, I can still make two more repair packs. Uh, do I have any more? I have two more mines I can put down. Because I remember it wasn't even coming in fully anyways. There you go. Hopefully this should do it for this place now. Rather unfortunate that we needed this much defenses, but now we got to work on the, the coal and then we can do some other stuff. It looks like they don't even come from here anymore, that's the thing. How many walls do we have left? We have a fair number. Alright, gun turn damage too. Alright, the last one needs now uh, military science research, which we, we cannot achieve at the moment. So we can either just start working on like engines or flammables or something else. But this is essentially the time I would basically like to be spending on... Um, I have all the defensive stuff. At this point, it's not going to get much better until we get flamethrowers. It's really not. So, like I said, this is usually the point of which I'm basically like, okay, we, we're working on military science now. Like, I haven't even upgraded these guys yet. That's how behind we are. Oh. I also need more steam engines, I think, because our power is not abysmal, but not doing well either. I can guarantee you though, as soon as we hook in two more plants here and we do a couple more things, we're gonna need the steam engine, so we might as well just get started on it now. So I think that's the second one. We need two boilers. Fortunately, it is incredibly heavy on the Department of Iron. Yeah, it just, like, the iron just doesn't make it to my to the end anymore. You're not even close. It's actually the saddest story I've ever seen. There you go. Whoops. 
Oh, you can only flip it once, apparently. Go figure. So, I mean, I, I'm not sure what else to do in this case. I mean, it's the scenario we signed up for, so... There we go. Okay, so that solves our power problem slightly. Uh, we still need more than this. Trying to get as many iron gears as possible. Because we need to make sure that the other iron line is actually fully saturated as well. Because it currently isn't. Because that's not coming in like solid. I, like I have enough problems as it is. Saturating some of these lines. Um, I really don't need help from the... the <laughs> I don't really need help... Uh, not accomplishing what I want here, so you know how we have to do this. Okay, let's start tapping in over here. Don't worry. All this endless uh, mining is going to pay off eventually. Oh wow, one of them actually almost is out of, uh, out of ammunition here. I just gave it like basically the rest of what I had. Now this would be a candidate for double walling, honestly, because of the amount I've seen here. And actually, we're gonna do that, but mostly on the, no, mostly particularly towards this side. That's the problem with this mode, is I can't quite predict where they're ever going to come from. And now, now our focus is purely upon the coal. And getting that over here. But we're going to have to move this stuff probably closer to the coal, because I don't think they're going to actually come from this angle anymore. They don't appear to come from it at all. But we would like to protect the coal. As best we can. Okay, I think that's enough. Uh, let's get some ammunition. I don't think I'm ever going to stop using that thing. Yeah, I see these two in the back. I mean, they're starting to get some, but... I, I swear it is actually the, the belt optimizations. They've done things to it. Oh, they have come here. Or maybe they haven't. I mean, I, I, can't, I can't really know. All I know is that we're gonna have our defense down here now. Hopefully they're not gonna like bypass this somehow. As you've seen on several occasions, they sometimes just all willy-nilly decide, hey, you know, fucking can just walk right past it. But that's kind of what this uh, scenario is all about. It's how do I not waste time doing uh, <laughs> Doing doing maintenance. How do I, and the thing is you can't automate this right now. It's just not possible to. Can I get more of these? Yeah, I can get two more. Awesome. That will be enough actually. All right, I'm pretty satisfied with this. There we go. So we're going to just have it come through up here. Yeah, this is looking good, actually. It's actually what we like to see. Can I get a splitter here? Yes, I can. Fortunately, it looks like uh, we actually need more of this stuff. Fuck. Just slurp up a bunch. No, 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 no. Don't make burner fucking inserters. Yeah, that's the, that's the crappy kind of inserters. So we're going to do something a little bit more ingenious here. Um, so we're actually going to take this one this way. Reason being is that this is the newer one. There you go. So now we have more coal coming in from that side. Um, and it will come to both sides, so it's fine. And this one will still tap out. 
uh, as, as needed. Um, as I said, we can just kind of build into that one and it's, it's okay. So, but what we need to do now, actually, is we need to uh, start focusing upon our steel production. So I think I'll make it like right over here or something. So it has to kind of be something I can just expand outward. It doesn't have to be incredibly complicated either. Here's the thing, if I destroy this, well, the biters hate me, because I don't actually know if they've they've been here recently. I kind of judge it based upon corpses. I'm going to assume they haven't been here as of late, so. Because the thing is, there's going to be a blind spot here if I do this. But, hey, that's reality. Whoa, why do I have an extra radar? I'm sure I had a reason for having that. Um... We have seven. Let's go with like maybe. Actually, I have like two more here. Right, we're going to delete all these. So this layout here served us incredibly well, but it is uh, entirely needed to be something kind of different now. So uh, I, I do things over here. Uh, we should probably also try and get ourselves some more uh, iron as well. Sorry, some more uh, belts. It looks like the, these belts are good, so yeah, let's go get those. Alright, I just decided I'm here, so I might as well accept this for a little bit, because... Oh my... Look how much is, like, damaged here. I've seen some shit, let me tell you that. Flamethrower tech cannot come fast enough. And it looks like our coal is backed up nicely, so that's good. Um, we do need to bring the coal over here somehow. Um, we may actually just decide to do some voodoo magic. So voodoo magic is what we're going to do. Uh, and this, this is going to look like total bullshit to you guys, but that's fine. I think you guys will suspend your disbelief for a second. So the way it works when you have coal like this is it actually just loads in from one side. Um, so what you can actually do is I can tilt this this way. And I can actually do something like this. And this is actually only going to grab coal. Believe it or not. Uh, yeah, no, it's total, total fucking bullshit, but it will actually it will only take coal from that side. So... Uh, when I said I was doing some voodoo magic, I actually wasn't kidding. Uh, from here. Oh, one got through there. Alright, so he, we found the nonconformist that didn't take the bait. That's fine, though. I mean, we could also, like, try... We can also try and close this in over here somewhere. Maybe that's actually the play. But I really don't want to actually touch this, honestly. But we're going to actually just try and leave it as it is. So what we're going to do instead is we're going to mess around with this stuff. If, okay, that is powering the entire factory. So... Uh, I'm at a loss of what to do for these power poles, honestly. Just kind of do something like this, maybe. Good enough. All right. So this is gonna go up this way. Uh, probably needs to be actually a little bit less. Close to that side, but you know what? Yeah, let's, let's, let's fucking make it a little bit better. I just want to leave some potential space. You never quite know what you'll want to do. How many of these furnaces do we have? So it's the same thing as before. But this is just for steel, and this is, believe it or not, is actually sufficient enough.
As long as we split it accordingly. Engine finished. All right, nice. Nice, nice. Uh, so we can now go into some other stuff like... Uh, uh, I guess we can start getting the oil processing. We're also going to need fluid handling, though. Not actually as important as just doing oil processing, though. So we're already getting into the oil stuff, but the thing is to get to the flamethrower turrets, we need military tech. So what did, it, what did I need from over here? What was I just doing? Yeah, I was, sorry, I remember now. I was going to get these uh, inserters. We don't need a huge amount of steel right now, but it is like a, a resource that we're actually going to need a lot of. But luckily we have like a bunch of that in, in our inventory, which is uh, good for us to start. Uh, yeah, we can just do this. So this will take as much that's required. Oh, they actually destroyed it. Oh, because this one ran out of ammo or what? Fucking bugs. <laughs> Apparently the bait strategy worked maybe a little bit too well. Yeah, that's all I got, got destroyed. Hey, you know what? If that's all I got destroyed, I'm a happy camper. Alright, so we need to make our way over here. So this is where our steel is going to come down. It's going to basically just come down the middle line here. So we don't have to worry about this anymore. This is better than our other setup that we had previously. Uh, oh, they do come from over there. Alright, this is actually a good opportunity for us to uh, ammo up and actually just check all the sides and make sure that we're okay. Let's see here. Okay, this is running out of ammo, so we're going to have to actually head over there. Yeah, I mean, this, is it moving, this stuff? I mean, it's just barely, like, just having little gaps there. It's weird. Like I said, 50 is, like, the magic number. How's this doing? Perfectly fine. I mean, that, that I think, was low to begin with, but that's okay. Can hold out. This one needs a bit more. Oh, that's completely out. Oh shit. Why well, it's good that we spent a second to do this. Yeah. This barely held itself here. We actually may need more than this. Uh, yeah. We we may need more things making ammunition. Luckily we can just leave the copper now. It's not the problem anymore. Uh, okay, where's... Okay, let's make one more machine making ammo. Actually, this one's just slightly too slow, but that's fine. Two things making it. Uh, it's just unfortunate that it's taking it from the, the one copper, the one iron supply I have, but that's all you can do, really. Alright, let's uh, let us do what we were born to do, which is science. Tons of science. Uh, this is the unfortunate part, which is uh, getting this to kind of work properly. Uh, gears, always gears. Okay, I don't want to. I don't want to be taking off that line. Kind of need. We kind of need all that shit. I'm not sure why this is so slow, but like this is like this is a, the most amount of iron I can possibly tap out of that stuff. So but we're actually gonna go now and do something a little different now. 
Uh, we're gonna do the ex the the, f the format I was gonna do originally, which is uh, one per second. Uh, that's what we were doing last time, but uh, it, we kind of made a whole bunch because we were desperately needing research. But now that's not as uh, not as much of a necessity. Plenty of green ships right here. I know we're still like m like manually feeding everything, and that may not seem the most efficient thing I've ever done on the planet, but you know. So these two don't need anything. I know it kind of extends a little bit too much to the side there, but I mean, there's not much I can do on that front. Uh, just need iron plates. Like as I said, I don't know what they've done with this. I, I, it actually kind of bothers me in a way, because this this stuff used to work, but now it doesn't. So, question of do what do you want me to do? The answer is nothing. How's our power doing? Power is good. All right. So this is going to require a little bit of planning, a, just a slight bit of planning. Um. So we're going to make an abundance of things like underground belts and whatever else that we need. I know I keep having to do this, which is like, yeah. Like as I said, there's like no gaps, like there's little gaps like that maybe, but I don't know, I don't think that would cause the problem. I'm gonna take the ammo with us and just put it over there. All right, so I think I'm pretty set with the amount of things I have here. I just need a little bit more gears. Actually, just may, may need more gears coming down the line. Although I can't really make any more than that, so oh, been pasta. Uh, yeah, this, this is good now. They may actually they have the range ones now because uh, one of the turrets was hit in the in the center, and I had actually no reason to be hit. So I think. Evolution has now reached a state. Yeah, they now spawn range spitters. This only this simply only means that um, they occasionally the things will take damage, and I'll have to come over and deal with it. Um, yeah. So let me plan this out properly. Hopefully. So usually how this goes is I do another line here. So we need another line of science because obviously this belt is full. I guess we can just make it over here or something. So the way it works is we make um, we make two military science packs every ten seconds, which means we need we need five assembly machines making this stuff. So uh, yeah, yeah. So we need five assembly machines making this, and there's two. Uh, very fundamental resources that we need coming from this. Uh, the first being ammunition, and the second one, uh, well, it, it's, it's a couple of resources, but uh, so we need ammunition. Uh, ammunition is kind of the tougher one. Fortunately, we still need more iron plates. Don't worry, at some point we'll do all the quality of life things, like the research and whatever. Uh, we're gonna have to go back down there for that one for a minute. In a minute, and I'll do all the I'll do all the quality of life stuff a little bit later. <laughs> Trust me. This factory is just eating through iron. Fuck. Yeah, they found the blind spot again. Ah. Uh. I don't want to be doing this all the time, so we're going to do what I do best and just be lazy and kind of put it down here or something. I don't have any more of these. Yeah, I don't think it even needed any more, to be honest. It's just bitching that I destroy them. So the bait strategy did not work. They didn't just go after the... They didn't go after what they were supposed to, but it's okay because we don't actually need that much more... Of copper anyways. Well, we will a little later, but yeah, whatever. I'm doing the best I can, what can I say? What do you want from me? Alright. 
So, uh, we're gonna have to do something like this. Uh, something like that. Is that what we want? So these will make piercing ammunition. So piercing ammunition uh, makes one every three seconds. Remember, we're going to try to make one every second. Uh, given the assembly machines, uh, just assume the assembly machine crafting speed is one. So we try and make one every second. Uh, we gotta put it on this thing. So, so they, they need also copper and steel plates. And we're gonna try and still make the, I don't think we've gotten to the point where we're gonna be so desperate that we have to like skip all the nice fancy shit we've been doing this whole time. Uh, so we need the copper to get over there. Yeah. Actually, we can do it slightly better than that. Oh, I just want these inserts more towards the center. Uh, so I was gonna have them kind of combine over here. What you're complaining about now? Yeah, that's the spitters for you. Hit one of my turrets there. The turret may have been out of ammo. We kind of have to go over there and deal with that right now. That's what they do. Uh, luckily oil processing finished. Whoops. Where did I just put that? All right, there. So now we have to decide what we want to do next. All right, uh, for next research, I think it's fluid handling and then we go into flammables and stuff. All right, what's... Yeah, I was just, I think I was just complaining that that got destroyed, but I don't know much we can do on that. So, steel is the second thing we're going to have to bring over. So that's one. Shit, we need more. I just kind of wish I had more steel. I, I probably I probably should have been early in the game just like like putting into chests, just stocking it up because I just I, you need it for everything. Uh huh. Something like this. Actually. Well, they found a angle there and they also destroyed another one right there. So, I'm not sure if we've just lost because I don't even have what I need yet. <laughs> I'm going to, going to truck through with it and see how we go. But they're now sending the ranged ones at us, so we may be in a tough spot now. All right, so this is kind of what we need. All right. All right how do we bring some iron down here? be in trouble now because I can't be going over there and kind of like doing with that every time one of them dies so because there's clearly something going on with that Okay, I think the game is over. Uh, yeah. So, <laughs> um, well, that's a problem right here. This is a new one. A new nest. Uh, 
What is the evolution factor based upon right now? 0.27 times 68% pollution, 27% spawner kill, 6%. So that is the factors for this. Huh. Well, the thing is, I think time was obviously the biggest factor in this right now. Um, there's... Okay, so uh, I, I'm i not continuing this particular run, but I will attempt it again. Uh, didn't expect to get a failure right off the bat, but um, I think I did waste too much time. I think that was the first thing. I wasted too much time at the beginning. Um, obviously, the pollution is not something I can do much about because we just have to pollute. Um, we were just barely on the precipice of getting the military tech. I, I'm not going to be able to do it just simply because I can't get up to the military tech that fast. I think I did spend maybe a bit too much time talking about this stuff, but, um, I think this is an issue here. I mean, the, the iron doesn't come out fully. I'm not sure why, but it's kind of a problem. I mean, they, they, this one's kind of fully going. This one over here, but this one over here is not. I'm not sure why that is. Like, because look at this crap. So, side loading has been really fucked up, and I'm actually kind of curious on if you can fix that right now. So, I'm having an issue with side loading, and I think it's honestly giving me far less resources than I, and I need more than this. Let's try this. Yeah, it just side loading just sucks now. Why? Look at this. So, while this did work in my previous one, I think it's just like six of the uh, six of the furnaces on both of them don't go all the time, which results in drastically less um, resources, and I need more than that. I think that's the first thing. The second thing is me having the iron patch down there is actually very detrimental. Because uh, as you can see, I've had to kind of spread my resources out a little bit, which obviously isn't great. Because I, I have to, like, whenever whenever I go and I have to reinforce this, I have to walk all the way down there, reload it, come back up, continue what I was doing. Um, and there's not much I can do on that front. Um, I, I, I think I will continue with this seed. I'm not sure, though. I may do I may do the original seed I was intending on doing. But I will do it off screen since I did kind of just um, do the introductory thing because I think a lot of it is me having to talk during a sequence of things that um, is difficult for me to plan out because it's I have to work incredibly fast. Then again, it is kind of like a um, it is a fun thing to kind of kind of see like because you want to see exactly how I do everything, you know. So. I don't know, I, I may decide on another seed, I'll have to plan it out, if I'm going to do either another seed or something else. Uh, but I think you guys get the gist of the game, and the difficulty of it. And I'm still, I'm still determined uh, to make this work. It's just the fact that when we got to this, when we got to this level and we didn't upgrade our turrets or anything, that's when things went to hell. Guaranteed. That's when, that's when things went bad. Like I said, I, I may actually go to my original seed, because I think that one was slightly better in terms of resource spawns. Look at this. Look at this fucking shit. Every single angle. And it's simply because I was too slow given the evolution factor went up too far. That's that's honestly what happened here. Evolution went too far up. So hey, you know what? It's an LP I actually failed. Uh, well, I, okay, I didn't fail the... Yeah, this right here, this tells you right here. This is too many. So we, like, this is the time we needed the flamethrowers and it's obviously not going to happen now. Um, because they're destroying everything here. So, I mean, I'm, I'm more, I'm, I'm, I'm going to give it another crack, and we're going to just, I guess, start off from square one, but you get the idea of why things are difficult. You make mistakes, you're not optimized in, in, in how you do things, and this, this is a huge fucking problem. I'm going to look at what the hell to do about this, because I've just started this one since the belt optimizations or whatever they did to the game. This is, this ruined my run, I would say things that used to work that don't work anymore this ruined it 
right now, like guaranteed. Um, they're working on fixes for this apparently, but it 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 basically destroyed the run. So we may have to do like a really crappy like coal in the middle with the two uh, ores on the sides and things like that. We may have to do that instead. I'm not sure. So uh, <laughs> don't worry, guys. We'll keep fighting, and then we'll win. So next time we're gonna we're gonna restart from the get go, and we're gonna we're gonna do a fresh run. So um, probably uh, as I said on a different seed, and I'll have it in the description of that one. So um, bow bow bow, we lost. Uh, no ammo to kill ourselves, whatever. <laughs>